are listening to the FTWpodcast.com, where we talk about wrestling in all of its laughable glory. Here's a clip from this week's episode. Lord Tensai and John Cena had a match at the end of the show, and the only way I can describe it is I got a slab in my ranch house, and uh, we had this uh, trim piece of flooring in between the wood and the carpet, and I had to nail it back down. So what I had to do is uh, I'm nailing it down, I'm hitting it with a hammer, and the, ha- the nail's just not going in because I'm hitting the concrete. So finally what I decided to do is just get a bigger and bigger and bigger hammer to the point that I actually break the piece of trim. Lord Tensai defeated John Cena. Uh, they want Tensai to be this big badass so bad that they book this match and have him beat John Cena. And it, to me, it's just square peg and round hole. The crowd is not behind this. I mean, even in other countries, it's not behind it. It's just, it's not selling. I thought they were completely behind. They were behind Tensai. They were behind Tensai because he was beating John Cena. But when Tensai, when they announced that it was Tensai that was going to be up against John Cena, everyone was like, all right, I, you know. Go back was, to the tape, dude. They popped. And there were so many Albert chants, go, Albert chants going on. That's out. the problem is everybody remembers him as Albert. No one's buying this. Lord's, and I know WWE has to kind of like wink and nudge to it, but it's just, look, it's just not doing it for me. And I got to be honest, I think there's so much more they could do. I mean, they could give him Kane's entrance. They could do something like that. Make it more intimidating because right now he comes out to dust in the air and it's just okay. All right. Well, besides your your inability to accept him, that match was a pretty good match. It was a pretty good match, to be honest. Both guys did a really good job on that. Uh, it seemed like I was really worried that they were just going to squash Cena because it would just, I don't know, I, I would just hate Tensai even more just because it, it's such a cheap way of going about it. But, uh, I mean, it was it was a fair match kind of near the end. I mean, when they got outside the ring, it was just kind of blah. Uh, if beat him using the green mist, which that can't be fun. I mean, you got to think Tensai... First off, he's a big guy. I mean, it's Albert, kind of chunky. His mouth can't taste very good, all that sweat. And he's going to spit in your face with green liquid. I'm assuming Kool-Aid. That props to Cena for taking that because he had to get that in his nose and in his mouth and everything. Well, that's yeah. the thing, though. I mean, you know, the the internet complained for two straight weeks because he was spitting like this, this water mist. Okay, it was just this clear liquid. And then all of a sudden... You know, WWE listened and gave him the green mist because that's more realistic. That's something that we've seen before, yeah. and we're still shitting on it. And I, I don't, I don't understand why. Like we, we are refusing to accept Lord Tensai as you know our Lord a good, and Savior. A no, good you're absolutely character. right. Girl. He's, he's a good. It's a good character. It's a good character, except it's not being fleshed out enough. Other than a wrecking ball, and it feels like. Look, when Karma, like I, I, I still I, think you need. I still think you need to give this one more time. You, you're still. No, I don't. Because you want no, because you want this I big want, explosion. You want Kane's entrance. No, you want, want Kane's Trump. entrance. It doesn't need it. Man, this no, is no, part no. of building this character. It's but, not gonna. He, he's gonna do the Japanese thing. He's gonna come out. They're gonna throw some salt, and that's gonna be it. <laughs> it's Karma. Karma had that. She had. It was. You can you can do it. You can do it without. You can do it without the fire and the smoke and the you know blacking out the lights and everything. They did that with karma, but it was still because you were like, holy shit, this is going to be awesome. And it just feels like with Tensai, they're just not getting that. I don't know. Maybe I'm tired of this. We have a major new entrance, and now he's going to squash everyone for four weeks because they did it with. I mean, they did it with Brodus Clay. They did it with uh, Sin Cara. The pro- they- but the problem with Brodus Clay and the problem with Sin Cara is a lot of these guys were not upper card guys they were mid card and lower and 10 side just beat john cena that's the thing i mean it's like great the, uh, and top guy chat, top well, guy it, yeah but here's a good point from the chat how are we supposed to believe that cena can beat lesnar if he can't beat albert do you, but there was oh, a lot cheated, of didn't he? technically he cheated i guess yeah, well, well yeah it was so, an extreme rules match so yeah, you had so, david atunga get involved um and then yeah. you 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 had uh ten size manager get involved and then ten yeah. with the, the spray so technically it was according to the rules but you could say he cheated i don't know but it, 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 joe's got a point in fact that now you're like well ten size a force to be reckoned with but it's like it just doesn't feel like he really earned it like when karma was kicking ass and taking names i felt like she she was earning every second of it i mean that's cuz you wanted to see this big ass woman destroy these yeah. two big weak ass women so maybe it's, that would be great for tensai to go out there and beat these guys that were really annoyed with seeing that's what brodus clay's been doing <laughs> i know and then that's what everyone's complaining that brodus clay is doing yeah i don't it's, know i mean it's, it's just, been 3 weeks 3 weeks 
How much time do I have? A little bit more time. Just oh, a little bit more time. No, no, no. Maybe, give, maybe give another, another, you know, a pay-per-view at least. So I got to give it to Extreme Rules in order to care about Tensai. Apparently, um, since you just won't give him give him an even a chance, just because he didn't impress you in the very first three seconds, apparently you've written him off. Yeah, I'm sorry. That's what you get. You get three seconds. You got to come out there and you're competing with <laughs> airtime against guys who have been in the company a lot longer, have busted their chops a lot longer. If you're going to come in and make a debut, you better make a fucking debut. Don't come out here to this sand in the air and then putting your hands on a guy's forehead. Salt. Salt. Whatever. I don't give a shit. It's boring to watch. It's not TV. This is America. That shit will fly in Japan. And look, like... Okay. It's part of, the, yeah, the, the stuff so, will fly in Japan, the, but that's part of the gimmick here, sir. The, 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 oh God, I hate this word. The smark in me loves the fact that it's different, but I'm just taking the point of view of the casual fan. And that is that this shit is just, it's not working. I'm not buying it. Anyway, uh, moving Bill, on to. Bill, what'd now, you think? What'd you think of Lord Tensei? Um, I mean, I see what they're trying to do with him. Uh, it is kind of. I mean, it's not really. I don't. I, mean, I, I don't want to use the word boring. I think it's kind of, it's kind of maybe falling flat. But like, here's the thing: is like with him, is like with with the whole thing going on right now, with like Lesnar coming back and all this stuff, and just coming off of WrestleMania. Like, there's only so much focus they can put on the dude. So, I mean, I'd say probably a month or two from now, they're gonna the dude's gonna have a lot a lot more opportunity. Right now, they're just kind of like they want to get him out there. And but they can't do everything they can do with him. But right now they're in like the establishment phase, and it's gonna be boring until they kick it up to the next level with him. Because I mean, like you watch him, it's like okay, cool, like you know he's been really big in Japan, like that's good. But I mean, like like I mean, like he has kind of fallen flat. But I'd say just give it a just give it a little bit. That's that's about it. I guess. But I mean, how much time, how much leeway can we give this guy? I mean, how much of a curve can we grade this guy? Yeah, he was well, I mean, really great. Think, like we think, we think a lot different than like you know, like the normal fan. You know, like, and I mean, like even though they may be bored with him, like they're like this dude is killing everybody that he wrestles, and oh my god, he just beat John Cena, like a little kid, who they still, even though they're kicking up the product a little bit, they're still marketing towards the kids. Like, oh my god, this guy beat John Cena. So I would expect now maybe after he beat the after he beat Cena, I would expect maybe Tensai to get his first program, and it'll probably be against uh, you know like an upper mid card, pretty viable guy, and you know they'll they'll drag that out a couple of weeks. But I mean, like I said, just give it some time. He'll kick it up. He'll kick it up. I mean, this is just what I'm hoping for. Right right now, it feels like like where we are right now. It just seems like. This is where we start to get awesome, and I'm just waiting for them to slam that gas pedal down. And it just doesn't look like that they have any sense of doing that. I mean, yeah, he beats John Cena. whoop de shit John Cena's not in a program with him. He's got to fight against Lesnar in a few weeks at Extreme Rules. I mean, that's all right. Lesnar's well, energy thing, and everything is the whole thing. The whole thing with, like, you know, Otonga and everything. I mean, now at Extreme Rules, you can probably expect something like that with, uh, you know, in the Lesnar Cena match. It'd be Otonga and probably Laurinaitis and you know, everything else, and it'll be like, oh, Cena to come to this in the match with Lord Tensai with, you know, Otunga, the manager, and everything, and Cena overcome it there against Lesnar, and then, you know, it'll that whole thing of what they did Monday was just to add another dimension to that match, and, you know, unfortunately, you know, they're trying to give this guy a big push, but in the end, that's probably all that was for was the enhancement for Lesnar and Cena's match in a couple mm. of weeks. Maybe. No, it'd be really interesting to see. Well, you've heard our thoughts, but now we want to hear from you. You can find us on Facebook and Twitter, and even join us live every Tuesday at 8 p.m. at the FTWpodcast.com. 